Jackie Cooks. Hey guys, thank you so much for stopping by the channel today. If you are new here, welcome. Sit back, relax, and enjoy this awesome recipe. Today, we are going to be making the most incredible, delicious, delectable lemon icebox pie. We're going to start off by making the crust. I'm going to use my handy dandy mini processor. Altogether, I'm going to be using about 20 cinnamon graham crackers that I'm going to be crushing up. This is the easiest pie crust you will ever make and the most delicious. Now there is an alternative if you don't have any type of food processor. Please excuse me for a minute. Someone's at the door every time I make a video. It happens. Okay, guys, I'm back. You can always use a Ziploc bag, a hammer, or a rolling pin. We want to just keep pounding those graham crackers until they turn into finely crumbs. Beautiful, fine crumbs. And it should look something like this. Oh, this feels so good in my hands. Looks kind of like wet sand. And it's okay if you have a few chunks. We're gonna add in a half a cup of dark brown sugar. Uh-huh. Because butter makes everything better. The buttery flavored crust. I'm using one stick of unsalted butter. You are going to love this crust. We're gonna put our crust mixture in a nine inch spring form pan, but you could use a nine inch pie pan if you prefer. You guys know I am a smell freak. And the graham crackers, the cinnamon, the brown sugar, and the butter, oh my God, I'm about to have a fit. <laughs> now that we have our crust mixture pressed into the pan, we're gonna refrigerate for one hour. If you are enjoying the video so far and you are new here, please subscribe. I gotta tell you, make sure that your cream cheese is completely softened or your filling will be lumpy okay we're going to be using freshly squeezed lemons do not use lemon extract or store-bought lemon juice we're going to add 16 ounces of room temperature softened cream cheese to a large bowl you can put your cream cheese in the microwave for about 15 seconds on high we're going to use our hand mixer to make it extra creamy and extra smooth and this makes it light, fluffy, and easy to spread. Now we're gonna be adding in two cans, which is 28 ounces of sweetened condensed milk. This pie is a Southern favorite. You can also make it in an eight by eight square pan, pop it in the freezer, and whenever you want one, just grab a square. This is what makes this pie phenomenal. One cup of freshly squeezed lemon. This pie is tart and sweet. If you don't like that much lemon, just put half a cup. Just for a crunchy lemon pop, I'm gonna be adding in two tablespoons of grated lemon peel. The taste is amazing in this lemon icebox pie. This is the perfect Sunday dessert pie. Everybody loves this pie. Oh my God. We're just gonna pour that sweet and tart filling in our nine inch spring form pan because our crust is ready. Okay guys, we're just gonna give it a shake, 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 shake. This is the easiest pie you will ever make. No baked, buttery tasting crust. Let's just put it in the freezer for six hours. I love the spring form pans. Let's unlock it and see what we got. Leave me a comment below. Looks good, don't it? I said it looks good. It's ready, y'all. Look at it. Look at it. Look at that. Ooh-wee. For those of you who don't like to decorate your pie with lemon or lemon is too much, you can have it plain. But we love the sweet, tart, lip-popping, lemony taste. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Talk to me in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.